Hi everyone, it's a Squirrel Man here with SquirrelNutrition.com. I'm here with my buddies Amos and Andy and I want to answer the question for you today that uh, a lot of people write and ask me about just how do squirrels stay warm in the winter time. Now there's actually four ways that they stay warm and I want to cover, I got my little cheat sheet here, I'm sorry I'm new to this video thing but I want to answer the question how do squirrels stay warm in, in the winter time. During the latter part of September and through October up here in the northern United States, the gradual shortening of the days or the, the amount of daylight hitting the, uh, the retina of a uh, squirrel's eye will actually trigger hair growth and cause them to start to put on a, a layer of protective fat. At least it's supposed to do that. Uh, I say that because some squirrels live uh, in o overpopulated areas and they have such a fierce competition for food that there's just not enough for them to eat to put on that insulating layer of fat. If you live in a cold climate and it's winter time and you see skinny squirrels running around, you'll know that they're just not getting enough food for nature to do its thing. A healthy squirrel can eat the equivalent of its body weight every week in the summertime and not put on one ounce of fat. Now just think about that. That'd be like me eating 246 pounds of food per week and not gaining weight? I don't think so. Okay, another thing that happens uh, is that a squirrel's hair will thicken and they'll grow a nice thick under fur that uh, provides them with a very warm coat in the winter. As you'll see here in a minute uh, when I take you outside for the, the fourth reason, uh, squirrels will grow tufts of white hair behind their ears that uh, acts as an, as an effective uh, windbreak for, for the, the delicate uh, tissues of their ears. Also their, their tail in the fall will get nice and fluffy. I know you've all seen squirrels sitting with their back to the wind with that that tail folded neatly up over their back. Uh, now, in, in the winter time, I love to have my squirrels uh, come up and get up on my shoulder and, 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 and during feeding time because if they turn just right, that big fluffy tail will sit right up against my, my ear. You would not believe how effectively that breaks uh, the bite of the wind. A third way that uh, squirrels stay warm in the winter is that God has given them a neat little valve at the base of, the, uh, base of their tail. And in the summertime, that valve is wide open, blood can flow through their tail, and the air passing through their tail will keep actually cool their blood. In the wintertime, the opposite happens. That, tail, or that, that valve will close down and restrict blood flow through the tail, effectively keeping warm blood in the main part of their bodies. I'm going to take you out back now for the for the fourth reason. Now, I'm, I'm going to have to be quiet when I'm out there because I got a dog living next door that just lives to bark. And it seems like every time I go out there to interact with my squirrels, this dog comes up and makes his present known, just continues barking, scares the living daylights out of my squirrels, and they, they go running up the tree. So we're going to head outside, and I'm going to show you the fourth way that squirrels stay warm in the winter. Okay, as you can see, the snow has come down and it's about 20 degrees out. So if I'm lucky, I'm gonna be able to show you the fourth way that squirrels stay warm. The fourth way that squirrels stay warm when it's really cold is that they sleep together. They buddy up and sleep together. And I'm gonna go up here and see if I can get, oh, here I see somebody. you can see, there's a squirrel in that box. Now, I'm going to see if I can get them to both come out. Come on, babe. Come on down. Come on. Let your sister out. There we go. There we go. Hi. Oh, you're a sleepy girl. You're a sleepy girl. Yeah. 
See, they both, I'm going to see if I can show you the tuft of hair behind here. See that little white tufts of hair? You see how chunky she is? They're just, they're just really ready for winter. But see, they, they get together in the box, and this is, this is uh, Lulu's box. It's not, that's Annie sticking her, sticking her nose out, uh, and this is Lulu here. The box is Lulu's, and Annie's welcome to stay in the box when it's cold. She's welcome to come in, but when the weather breaks and it gets warm, Annie has to leave. So that is how they, they'll get in there and they'll get down in the, in the dry leaves that she has in there and they'll wrap their tails around each other and they just stay warm as toast in there. Unlike me, I'm about ready to freeze my butt off out here. But that's the fourth way that squirrels stay warm in the winter. They buddy up. Well, there you have it. That's how squirrels stay warm. Now, to learn more about how to feed uh, squirrels the right food, you're always welcome to visit my website, www.squirrelnutrition.com. That's loaded with uh, squirrel advice for rescuing and feeding babies, for feeding squirrels the right foods to keep them healthy. And we offer free recipes for making healthy nutrition products for squirrels and even free plans for building squirrel boxes just like the one you just saw. We're always glad to answer any questions you might have about squirrels. Now that's squirrelnutrition.com, squirrelnutrition.com, your one stop for all your squirrel questions. Thanks for watching and have a wonderful squirrel loving day. Bye bye.